Hey, what's going on, everyone? Soul here, and welcome to, welcome to episode 15 of my Heart Gold Randomized Nuzlocke Challenge. In the last episode, we challenged and defeated Claire of the Blackthorn City Gym, completed the Dragon's Den, and then we received the Master Ball and completed the Tin Tower and Ho-Oh, or not really Ho-Oh. So, uh, in this episode, we are going to cross the water east of New Barktown. And we are going to start making our way towards Victory Road. Now, I don't know if we are going to do Victory Road um, in this episode or if we're going to, like, break it up into two parts. We'll just have to kind of play things by ear and see how long it takes um, to uh, get through. But yeah, this is... We're getting close to endgame here, guys. This is <laughs> pretty exciting. Hey! Do you know what you just did? You're taking your first step into Kanto. Check your poke gear map and see. I like to imagine he's just he's just here the entire time and he's just waiting for someone to just surf by and then once they do, he gets very excited. Alright, so we need to go into that cave and cross the waterfall, but first I'm going to go down here. See if there's an item or something. And there sure was. What do we got? <laughs> That was not worth the trip. All right. So I do have Lapras in my party. The Lapras is an HM slave. It has uh, Surf, Whirlpool, and Rock Smash. I don't remember what HMs I need to get, or need, rather, to complete Victory Road. I think I need Strength as well. If I do need Strength, for some reason Lapras can't learn it. I thought Lapras could. Um, but if I do need Strength, then I'll just give that to, like... You know, Neo or something, and then uh, replace Quick Attack with it, since I'm going to scrap Quick Attack anyway. Then I did give uh, Borderfall to Boardless. I think that's going to work out really, really well, because Boardless can... Uh, he has Dragon Dance. I did not mean to go down. Son of a bitch. Okay, cool. So we can catch a Pokemon here. Vaporeon. A level 22 Vaporeon. Glad to see the levels are still completely fucked. <laughs> I swear, if Victory Road doesn't have adjusted levels, I'm just... I'm just going to the Elite Four just raw. There's really nothing else I can do. I can't stomach trying to grind for another five hours to level people up. It's just not happening. When spins begin to vibrate, it is a sign that rain will come within a few hours. Um, need who draws. Okay, and a muscle band that raises physical attack strength. If I remember right. Wow, she's waiting to snipe anyone that walks out of that cave. It's rare to see anyone come here. Are you training on your own? That's a dirty trick, lady. Okay, 48. I can, I can handle that. Yeah, so I think I I think I'll have a fighting chance the Elite Four, assuming that I'm not just horrifically under leveled. Uh, because D's has the iron defense, and then I can do, like, the X special defense um, moves as well. And then, um, Borderless has Dragon Dance and Waterfall. And then he also has Smokescreen, or she also has Smokescreen. So, that'll work out great, where, you know, I can drag it, like, if I find, like, a really weak, like, under, not under leveled, but, like, base form Pokemon, um, then I can just you know, start statting up, you know, Dragon Dance or whatever. And then, uh, get my stats all the way up. And then hopefully start one-shotting things with Waterfall. 
Well, and the waterfall can also make opponents flinch as well, which might come in handy at some point. Let's see. All right, who's in this house? Where are you off to with Pokemon? The Pokemon League? Are your Pokemon loyal enough for you to win? Let me see. Ah, your Pokemon trusts you very much. It's nice to see a good trainer. Here, a gift for your journey. She gave me a TM. It happens to be Sandstorm. It's a move that inflicts damage on both you and your foe's Pokemon. However, some Pokemon, such as Rock and Ground and Steel type Pokemon, take no damage. There are other ways to avoid taking damage. I'll let you figure it out. Thanks. Um, you gave me metronome. I have two metronomes now. <laughs> Great. Thanks. Alright. You look pretty strong. Let me battle you. And they all have three Pokemon. Hmm. Please don't use explosion. Okay. <laughs> I was going to put in D's to, to wall the explosion, but then I'm like, if this Graveler uses Earthquake, that is going to just fuck D's up. So, I opted, I, I, I gambled, I went with Boardless. I think Explosion probably would have one-shot Boardless, but Earthquake would have really, really hurt D's. Giratina? Oh, you're shitting me. Okay. Um... I'd put in Miracle for Ice Beam, but this thing uh, almost assuredly has a Ghost-type move. Hopefully I'm faster. Okay, good. I can iron defense. I think this is a physical move. Okay, yeah. It's okay. It's definitely a physical move. Oh my god. Got a tanky boy here. And it has earth power too? You know, I was gonna bullet punch to save a, a, a psychic use, but now that I know it has earth power, yeah, I'm, not, I'm not messing with that. An earth ring. Oh my god, this route is gonna be. This route is going to be nuts. Not even at Victory Road yet. Oh, boy. Nice. At least a hammer arm one shot. I don't know what level Metagross learns Meteor Mash, but if he does try to learn it, I'd, I'm probably going to have to replace something with it. Would love having a super strong stab steel move. Hmm? You're good, aren't you? I think, Volt I think Voltage can handle it, right?
right? Oh my god. <laughs> we, we almost we almost lost Electabuzz. We're not even at Victory Road yet. We almost had to leave Electabuzz by the side of the road. Oh wow. Yeah, nice try trying to use Brian. Fuck out of here. Okay, let's let's put up light screen so I stop getting just ass clapped by this thing. <laughs> Alright. Oh boy. Oh boy. Are you guys ready for the Elite Four? I'm starting to get ready for the Elite Four. Oh man. I'm not even in their presence yet. And shit like this is happening. Oh. Just as I thought. Uh-huh. I regret giving Artie my number. He will not stop calling me. Alright. Alright, now I see this I see this patch right here. It's very suspicious. This is the screams item. Have I been tricked? Oh my god. Alright. Especially in Pokemon when there's a random little thing like that, usually it means there's gonna be something there. What's over here? Oh. All right, well, yeah, let's let's go past it. I'm curious. Wait, is this where I'm supposed to go? It looks like this might be where I'm supposed to go. Okay, yeah, I'm 100% supposed to go that way. All right, yeah, so we're going to go back. Cool. So it was just, it was literally just like a, 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 a shortcut. <laughs> okay. What's the blue flute do? That's not the blue flute. Where is it? Is it a key item? Yeah. Oh, okay, so it's like a permanent, like, awakening. Okay, well... And in the event I run out of my 20 full heals, I suppose that'll come in handy. Don't say a thing. Let me guess what you're thinking. Mmm, I got it. You're in the Pokemon League Challenge. Swimmer Landon. Can't discount his, his genius. Also, I'm noticing, and I'm sure you guys probably have too by this point, uh, that we haven't seen any trainer with a unevolved Pokemon that I can actually, that I can remember. They've all been evolved. So, I doubt that's a coincidence. It seems like, um, this ROM is going to be using fully evolved Pokemon from here on out. From trainers, at least. So there goes my, there goes my dream of, uh, oh my god. Yeah, uh, pardon me sir. There goes my dream of the Elite Four having, like, you know, some chuckle fuck that I can set up on and, and feel safe against. <clears throat> I'm pretty sure Waterfall will one-shot. I'm pretty sure. But I'm not 100% positive. So, I'm going to see what he uses next. If he uses Earthquake again, I'll just Waterfall. Okay.
Alright, yeah, let's just waterfall. Okay. I get the feeling there's going to be a lot of holding my breath and, and seeing what happens moments. It just... <laughs> oh, God, it just, it just feels, it just feels like that. Okay, thankfully this Gengar doesn't hit very hard. And then hopefully since I just use Smokescreen it misses, because I do have the Lex Incense equipped. Then I can start waterfall spamming. Watch this two shot anyway. I'm using smoke screen was completely just no point. Oh, at one shot. Oh, well, fuck. If I'd have known that. Okay. You're too much. Rhyperior, man. Oh, God. That's... That's straight panic mode right there. Because Rhyperior is one, two, three. Uh, he checks three of my five. You came from New Barktown? You must be exhausted. It's, it's the closest town to this route. Oh my god, a, a not fully evolved Pokemon. What the hell? Maybe there's hope after all. Knock on wood. Famous last words. Kabuto's floating in the air? <laughs> Why is Kabuto floating in the air? That's kind of funny. I remember with Kabuto's old sprite work, I thought his eyes were on top of his shell. I thought there were those, like, black dots. I thought that for a very long time. Ooh, that quadruple weakness plus crit. See ya. Like Grimer. Okay, yeah, this girl was a joke. Okay. So maybe there is hope after all that the Elite Four <laughs> won't be a bunch of level 80 fully evolved. Maybe it'll just be level 80 and, you know, mid. Okay, sweet. Oh, you're much too strong. Not too shabby. You're doing right, something right if you can beat me. Even an unlikely fluke. I like you. Give me your number. You can be my practice partner. Nope. I don't believe it. You're going to regret this. Yes, lady in the middle of absolutely nowhere. I'm going to walk out here every single time you call me and want to battle you. Mm-hmm. This guy, oh man, this guy's itching for a fight. Battery's tweaked out on something. Every time... <laughs> Man, I'm feeling great today. I feel like I didn't even beat the league champion. Oh, he is tweaking. Oh, boy. Does that bounce? Well, I can't hit it, so I guess I'll just put a blade screen. <laughs> Good one. I think Bounce is flying type, anyway. For some reason. I mean, I get... I kind of get why, but... I don't know. I feel like it should be normal type, if anything. Okay. Switch on back to uh, Neo.
beautiful. Okay. I should be able to one-shot this thing, no problem. Nice. No, not in this battle. It's like a fishing. It's all over in Pokemon if you give up. True. Right, come on. Wow, look at all those badges. I'm impressed. But you're not satisfied by just collecting them, right? No, I'm not. I have to go challenge Elite Four for the pleasure of the people watching. This Tauros is... Hmm. These people love to see me suffer in this game. My god. Okay. Thrash is fine. Dude, that's with it being resisted. Ooh, this Tauros. This Tauros is always strong. I've always liked Tauros. He's a really, like, decent option, for sure. He's probably my second favorite normal type. No, third favorite, because I love Eevee and I love uh, Snorlax. Ah, oh, Bullet Punch is so good. It's so good. Good battle. Oh, that guy's nice. Good sport. Arnie, stop. It's the second time he's called me now. If I go this way, oh, I'll have to climb all the way back up. Yeah, no. Oh, that's right. That lady will heal you at that house. <gasps> level 32. The levels did go up. Oh, my God. Okay. It's not much. But it did increase. <laughs> <laughs> might, be able to, might be able to farm at Victory Road after all. Okay. Um, oh, we can quick attack. Quick attack won't kill it. Oh, definitely won't just kill it now. That should do it. Let's try an ultimate now. Good. When the water warms, they inflate the flotation sack on their heads and drift languidly on the sea in packs. <clears throat> Okay. You know, we're gonna name we're gonna name him her Pie. I like Pie. Alright, and you know what, let's Typhlosion's so close to leveling up, let's do one more battle. Just level him up. Okay. Good. Um, let's put in voltage. Did you think you were lucky to find a place to rest right where you needed it? Don't be reserved. I look forward to people's smiles. Let your Pokemon rest here. There, your Pokemon are looking good. Keep at it. Aw, she's nice. She's nice. Good people here. Since you've come this far, you must be good. I'm going to give this battle everything I've got. <clears throat> That's scary to hear in a Nuzlocke. God.
finish off extra century. Okay, I got lucky with the mean look there at the end. I used to, I used to run Crobat back in uh, Gold and Silver and doing the Battle Tower. I think there was a Battle Tower back in Gold and Silver, right? Or maybe that was Ruby Sapphire. I can't remember. I, I know for a fact I used to run one, and he had um, Confuse Ray, Toxic, um, Sludge Bomb, and something else. He was pretty nasty. Confuse Ray and Toxic is such a gross combo. Oh, I think, I think it was Fly. I think it was Sludge Bomb, Fly, Confuse Ray, Toxic. Because then fly, even if they got through the confusion, that would just be up in the air. <laughs> it was so cheap. Okay. Keep heading up. What's the sign say? Impending doom forward? Yes, impending doom. Alright, here we are. We're on the way. Uh, left or right? We'll go left. Just kidding. We'll go right. Just my trainer right there. Yup. Alright, last super potion. We've officially graduated up to the big boy potions now. Hyper Potion and Full Restore. What does Sacred Ash do? Revise all fainted Pokemon. In doing so, it also fully restores their health. Well, that will never be useful ever. You know what? Let's, real quick, let's move the Hyper Potion there. And then we're going to move Full Restore here. Alright. And I have one elixir and one ether and then two max ethers. So that might be helpful for the Elite Four just in case I'm leaning heavily on Metagross. <coughs> Experiencing tough battles. You gain power. Yes. True. All right. <clears throat> Ooh, that's good. That's good stuff. Ooh, and then the one shot to cap it off. Nice. Oh man, okay. So yeah, as we're getting closer and closer to Victory Road, we're starting to see the levels increase a little bit. When the trainers had three Pokemon, they were all at 45. Now they're all at 48. And we just saw, I think it was, what, level 54 Crobat in the last battle? Ah, life is even tougher. Yes. Wow, you're tough. I haven't battled that series in a long time. Can I get your phone number? I'd like to battle again to heal my Pokemon. No? Okay. I understand. But change your mind. Can reach out any time. I won't. Make my final preparation for the Pokemon League. <clears throat> Servant Pie. Oh shit, now he has three and he has, and his first one's at 50. <laughs> the levels are increasing in real time as we speak. Oh, that 
plus 53. Okay. I don't think you're a special attacker, but even so, I'm putting you to sleep. I feel like Dark Void can low-key come in handy. It's going to be like a Dark Horse kind of helpful thing to the League. AD accuracy in a sleep move is pretty crazy. Really? Celebi was only worth 600 experience? What? That is very odd. Okay. So that looks like the last trainer before I enter Victory Road. Oh boy. Okay. <clears throat> Hyper Potion Miracle up, and then after this battle, I'll uh, loop back to that house, get everyone fully healed up. And then, uh, it's Victory Road time. I lost to a red-headed trainer. He was really strong, but it was as if he absolutely had to win at any cost. I felt sorry for his Pokemon. Gosh, now who could that be? Did they have a nursing degree by any chance? Ooh, Lax Incense doing its job. There we go. Then the crit. A Vigoroth and an Omanite. What an interesting two two Pokemon this this person had. Two crits in a row. Woo! Miracle Miracle's getting pumped up. The uh, Victory Road's right there. Pokemon aren't tools of war. You're very good at battling. We should battle again sometime. But challenge yourself to train like you. I think you get better too. How about up? Will you give me your number? No! That's too bad. Let me know if you change your mind. Arnie! Doesn't that double the amount of money I get from battles? If I'm remembering right. That sounds right. Yeah. Great. Getting, getting that at what amounts to the end game is, uh, yeah. No. Alright, let's head back to that house. Get everyone fully healed up. No, nope, wrong way. Route 26, Pokemon League Reception Gate. Okay. <sighs> Victory Road, people. Here we go. Only trainers who have proven themselves may pass. Oh, the eight badges of Johto. Please, go right on through. This way, at least, Mount Silver. You'll see scary strong Pokemon out there. You're not ready for it. Please let me go train. Please let me go train. I'll just, I promise, I'll just stay to the wild Pokemon, and that's it. Oh. <sighs> Okay. Huh? That's Wheelie Sekanto. This pass blocked for the time being, I'm afraid. Why? Dunno. Here we go! Victory Road! And I do need strength. <laughs> Immediately see a rock that I need strength on. Alright. <clears throat> Hmm. 
Oh, wait, Boardless is the only one that can learn Strength. Um... Well, that's a problem. I don't have... So, and there's no PC. So my alter... My, the only thing I can do is, uh, if I don't want to give him Strength <coughs> is um, go all the way back to... Not even New Barktown. I'd have to go all the way back to... Um, the second town. I can't remember what the second town's name is. And then withdraw. Oh my god. No, that's that's just too much of a pain in the ass. I can't be fucked to do all that. <laughs> Alright. Well, I'm not getting rid of Dragon Dance. I could get rid of Eruption, because Eruption's a TM. So I could just buy him another Eruption. Before the uh, Elite Four. Because I don't want to get rid of Dragon Dance, and I really don't want to get rid of Smokescreen either. Yeah, we're just going to just temporarily get rid of Eruption. I can't believe Wardless is the only one that can learn Strength. I feel like that's 100% not supposed to be the case, especially with Metagross. You know? <laughs> what the hell? Oh, wait. I almost messed up right away. I think, I think he put in a thing to where... Uh, only certain Pokemon can learn certain TMs and HMs. A Starly. Wow, what an absolutely horrid Pokemon to run into is my first. Also level 32. So it looks like the wild Pokemon are going to cap low 30s for me to train off of. Yeah. Yeah, that's, that's not going to work. Where's my character? I'm invisible. I'm back. Alright. So Boardless is basically in a point now where he can't fight anything unless it's weak to water or neutral to water. <laughs> Did I not use a Max Repel? Wow, that'd have been great to run into instead of the Starly. Oh, I could have had a Garchomp. Well, I say this, but then I would have had a train set Garchomp up from 32 on level 32 Pokemon. So, never mind. Scratch what I just said. Just kidding. Okay, there we go. Alright, time to restart the emulator. Alright, I took a few hours break here, but I am back. And you're ready to keep on going. Hopefully this holds out longer this time. <laughs> it doesn't immediately crash on me. Okay, so there's nothing over there. Cross bridge. There's seemingly nothing down there. Hmm. Okay. Actually, if I remember correctly, I think this Victory Road feels, or is a bit smaller than, like, other victory roads. I don't know. I, I just remember that this victory road isn't that big of a slog. Or maybe that's just nostalgia, just talking, and I don't actually remember. Okay, so I can go up, or I can go right. Um, let's try going up. Okay, so I can't go up. I can go right, however. Okay, repel fell off. Put that right back on. Oh boy, this place is like a giant maze. And I keep going up, too. Oh, okay. Okay, and then walk down here and around. Okay, cool. Personberry. Uh, 
Can I go around the hole? Okay, I can. Good. Is that the exit? Is that already the exit? Really? Oh, great. I get to pick a hole and hope it's the right one. Alright, well... Hold on, am I about to seriously be leaving? I think I think I'm right in front of the exit now, right? Oh my god, there's light. Is that really the exit? There's no way. I see that item back there. Hold on. We we ain't leaving yet. There's gotta be something. <laughs> there's gotta be something here. Worth a damn, right? What happens if I go down? It's probably not a good idea, but I'm going to do it anyway. Now where... Where is this? Ice beam. Okay. That's not a bad... That's not bad. It's not bad at all. Rock throw? That can't be real. There's no way in hell that's a TM. Oh my god. Yeah. 50 base power. Uh huh. Alright, let's go find out if this is indeed the exit. Oh my god, it is. What? Hold it. Are you going to challenge the Pokemon League? Victory Road is at its end, for sure. But did you notice? You didn't see any real trainers on the way, did you? Man, they were all spineless. Well, the fact that you have come this far means you're not one of them. But, your journey ends here. Because right here, right now, I will crush you. Alright, Antoine. Our last encounter. Let's make this memorable. Oh my god, he's got a full... He's got a full deck. Okay, he's immediately going to sketch whatever I use. I could give it smokescreen and just make it so that he can't actually hurt me at all. Hmm. Alternatively, if I wanted to cheese this fight, I could put in D's. Iron defense. And then all Smeargle's going to be able to do is just iron... Actually, you know what? <laughs> we're going we're gonna, to we're gonna troll Smeargle here. Oh my god, he only has one PP. <laughs> he stretch. Sketch is only a one use move. Oh god. And now he doesn't have any moves left. So he's just gonna just keep using struggle and hurting himself. Oh, this is this is fantastic. Okay then. Here we go. I got my defense up sky high now. All right, Antoine, what you got? You better send out a special attacker. You better send out like a fire type. That's good. That's gonna make me run for the hills. Hmm. Oh my god! Fisher! Oh fuck! Oh, that would have been a one. That's a one hit. That would have been a one hit kill if it had hit. What is that, 30 accuracy? I think it's 30 accuracy. I was confident as fuck, and then Antoine pulls out the fissure. Oh my god. <laughs> oh. Antoine, please. Oh, have mercy. Right, I'm Staravia. Okay. Dude, I didn't, I didn't mean for D's to just completely body this fight, but I'm not going to complain, especially since Doug Trio tried to use Fissure on me. Like, okay, okay, Antoine, you want to play that game? Yeah, get bullet punch, get priority.
Mmm, belly drum. All right, well, let's hope hammer arm hits. Well, goodbye, Linoon. <laughs> and level 60 is his highest. I see. Seems it wasn't just luck that's gotten you this far. It's tw it would seem so. Okay, I think Unknown just has some random just garbage move, right? Hidden power. Okay, well, let's put Boardless back in and get him some experience. Her some experience. Okay, well... Yeah, I didn't mean for D's to body this fight, but that's just kind of how things worked out once I realized I could troll the Smeargle. It's just, things just were, went all good there. I couldn't win. I gave it everything I had. What you possess and what I lack. I'm beginning to understand what that Dragon Tamer said to me. Antoine. I haven't given up on becoming the greatest trainer. I'm going to find out why I can't win and become stronger. When I do, I will challenge you. I'll beat you down with all of my power. Huh, you keep at it until then. I'll always be your biggest fan. Joey, fuck off. Okay, well, this victory road ended up being a total just, de de just it's just depressing. I'm used to victory road having like a ton of trainers in it and you know, it being, like, legitimately tough. And it's a long slog to get through, too. Like, it's big, but... This one, like, from start to finish, I could have gotten through in, like, a minute flat if I had had Repel on the whole time. It's very disappointing to me. We have made it, everyone. Indigo Plateau, the ultimate goal for trainers. Pokemon Le League HQ. I can't believe we made it here. And you know, all things considered, I think I did pretty damn well get here with how insane the level jumps were in this, <laughs> this ROM. Key through everything and the kitchen sink. Everything. Everything at me. And I made it with five of my six intact. I think that's pretty damn good. I think it's safe to say the Elite Four is... Because the rival wasn't as high as I thought he would be. I thought Antoine was going to be a little bit higher level, like low to mid-60s. So I think what's going to happen is the, the Elite Four is going to start low 60s, and then Lance is probably going to cap 70s. I don't know if, the, I, don't know if I can handle 70s. I don't think I can. Uh, obviously, I'll take Dizzy out. I'll probably end up putting in that Bayleaf, my my Ho-Oh, -Ho, into the sixth slot. And then maybe I'll try and level him up to catch him up with everyone else. But I, I don't see myself trying to do much training, if, if any at all. I might try and get everyone up to, like, maybe 55. But, like, how much of a difference is three levels going to make, you know? So, I, I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do, guys. But yeah, I am going to heal up. And then I'm going to go ahead and end this episode. So, in this episode, we didn't do too, too much, right? I mean, we, we crossed the water over into uh, Kanto and then made our way up to the Pokemon League. Went through Victory Road. Victory Road ended up being a complete joke. I don't. I didn't remember it being that short. Um, you know, no trainers or anything, so that was kind of weird. But yeah, next episode, guys, it's going to be it. It's going to be probably the final episode uh, of this rum, uh, me fighting the Elite Four. I don't think I'm going to do the Kanto portion, just because if I do somehow manage to beat Lance, I imagine pretty much everyone is going to be dead <laughs> by that point. Um, and trying to level up to even have a chance in Kanto doesn't sound fun. 
So I'm just, yeah, I'm just going to just kind of do the leaf four here and, and call it whatever happens, happens. But yeah, so thank you all so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. And I will see you guys in what will be the final episode next time. So keep an eye out for that, everyone. Thank you for watching. Take care. And I'll see you guys again here very soon. See you later.